Hey guys, Cheryl Fuller, Spiritual Wealth. How's everybody doing? 2019. Woo woo. Hey guys, I hope you guys are having an awesome 2019. I haven't made any resolutions except for one, which is staying in complete alignment to my higher self, which then I'm just guided. My intuition is guided. I feel like this year is going to be probably one of my hugest years yet as far as just um, manifesting um, even more than I've already have. Um, just to get into it, I have manifested the, the my man of my dreams, my husband. He is an, my uh, true twin flame that I've been married to for 20 years. So I have manifested love. I've manifested my family, my amazing family. I have two of the most adoring kids that are just beautiful, beautiful souls on the inside and the out. And I adore them both. And I'm honored to be a part of their lives. I'm honored to be a part of my husband's life. And we have really truly built a, a beautiful um, home together and a beautiful life together that I know um, people watching have got to see us grow and know we're not perfect and we haven't had the perfect the perfect road of course we've had our um, struggles and our ups and downs and all of that amazing things which is the most enjoyable part that's the journey enjoy the journey that's why everybody says enjoy the journey think about it when you go on a hike and you climb up a mountain you just don't get excited about going to the peak of that mountain and seeing the beautiful view and watching where you where you just came from and watching you know where you were you know you enjoy the butterfly you see on the way up the mountain you enjoy the the creek you may get to uh, to see you enjoy the beautiful view on the way up the mountain life is the same the same thing guys we get to enjoy the journey i have enjoyed the journey i believe um as i reflect on it now i could have enjoyed it even more but the great thing is that i have had that reflection and i've had that experience to even know that so it's an amazing blessing as well all right, guys, I just want to dive right into subconscious and our conscious mind and how if they do not, if they do not um, like uh, meet together as far as the same, uh, the same belief, then that's where we're going to feel that resistance. That's where we're going to feel those um, kind of like those contrast and also that resistance. Um, so picture this our conscious mind, which is our, like our ego and our subconscious mind. If they don't have the same beliefs, then they're gonna, then they're gonna, and then we're not gonna manifest the life of our dreams. So for instance, if you're, if you believe that you can meet your soulmate and have this, all that, or this and that, or whatever, but your subconscious believes that it doesn't, then guess what? You won't because your subconscious mind is what's controlling your manifestations. So in order to change that, because due to the fact that we have lived a lot of life, um, or we've lived a little life or whatever the case may be, we've lived a life of, we've lived a life in beliefs and programs have been in beliefs are just programs that are in our mind that we've believed long enough or somebody said to us long enough or we've told it and we ran around in our mind long enough to the words became a belief in our subconscious mind. And so therefore, that's what's going to run everything in our time. So the key to manifesting anything in your life is changing your subconscious mind. Your subconscious mind is the mind that's kind of when we're sleeping. So that's where that, that billionaire hypnotist are fine if you're looking for your soulmate or a loved one or whatever the case may be. Um, find those in there and I'm also gonna venture out and start making those so stay tuned for that that's gonna be it I just had that epiphany right now and it's dropped in more than once so yes I'm gonna be doing my own and so that will uh, be uh, helpful to me and to you and you can also do your own as well um, there's somewhere you can go we'll google it together we'll figure it out it doesn't matter we'll figure this out but we can make our own if you don't find anybody on that you like and you want to make your own you can do your own and that was actually i read that in a book which i, I haven't done it yet it was years that i read i don't even know which book it was but um i'm reading a new book and i wanted to share with you guys um i know i didn't do any um I didn't do Magic Monday or any of Meditation Monday or Two Come Quantum Leap Tuesday like I did last year. I am probably going to bring some of those back um, right now. I'm just kind of updating and doing whatever I'm drawn to do, um, whatever I'm doing felt a calling to do. And I did feel a huge calling to focus on the subconscious and the conscious mind today because that is very important. 
Um, because if we do not take care of that subconscious mind, we will not pro progress and we will not manifest anything that even if we believe in our conscious mind that we can happen, our conscious mind is going to basically override that. So um, with that being said, I want to keep this really short and sweet because I really want to get this point across to each and every one of you. Um, whatever our subconscious is believing and programmed as is what we will create. So match up the subconscious and the conscious and then guess what? Those, that's what will be created. So let's change the subconscious mind to match the conscious mind and start manifesting our dreams all the time. I'm so thankful and blessed to have had this um, epiphany and this moment and this day to share with you because I didn't even plan on doing a video. But like I said, I'm staying in complete alignment and so I'm following all my intuitions and following all of my guide, my guided system team. I'm tuned in, tapped in, and turned on on a daily basis, all day, every day. I, hopefully I highly suggest you guys do the same. Um, follow me if you're uh, feeling my vibe, hit subscribe and we will grow and learn together and manifest the life of our dreams together, guys. I'm so excited to keep sharing with you everything going on in my life. Have an awesome, blessed day. We'll see you next time. Peace out. Cheryl Fuller, Spiritual Wealth. Thanks for being here.